Absolutely loving this moment. Loop and tune on the solo skip. that GoPro? That's the one JR, let, the guy that oh. we're meeting tomorrow, he let me borrow yeah, his. I got Did you get a good one? You got the fit. Oh, look at that. You got the tail on the shot. You got it. Yeah, she's getting some nice. good photos. Okay. You ready? You ready? I'm going to take the fish out, Isla. Ready. Why'd you turn it off? Don't you? Aren't you gonna get a photo when I get this fit? Take the fish out? Yeah, but now you're doing that, so I'm going to turn it off. All right. Now it's all, Now I'm done with this. Yeah. How big it is? No. You want me to give you a hand pushing it up here? Mike? No, I got it. I'm going to go like this. Wow. There Take it is right there. Take Mikey's picture. Got it. But All right. I think you have dirty. So what we're going to do if I got a dirty hand, uh -huh. I have a little rag right here. Okay. So the first step is go behind the gills right here. Or I mean behind the pectoral fin here. All the way up to the head. Come down. That's it. Then, then we'll have the collars uh, that you take out of that. Okay. Then go tail cut here. Then you come down the middle, cut here, down to the spine. But again, the fish is going to wake up. No, I don't think he's going to wake up anymore. Remember, I stuck that skeleton in his head. He's not going to wake up. Okay, now we. But his, here. But his fish is going to shake. Along the spine. Um, when Uncle Mike is done, I'm going to take a picture. Okay. 
you're on the you're on the, the bone, right? The... Yeah, I went all the way down to the to the spine. The bones are still here on the fish. Really salty. You want to try a piece? It's got the it's got the flavor. The like flavor. A, like the ocean. Yeah. Yeah. You want a little small piece, Isla? No. It's really okay. good. Nice. You don't. You don't have to if you don't want. Why don't you get a uh, bring a little bring a little plate and I can put all the little scrap uh, pieces on the plate. Well, I'm gonna go finish doing my thing. You, okay. don't, you don't need my help, right? No, no, I'm good. Cut that all the way down right? to the bone. Well, That's I'm just perfect, saying, just uh, cut it all the way down perfect, to the bone. Yeah. But then I realized after I started going through, you're really supposed to uh, leave a wedge. Like there, there be a little of that dark meat. That's why I was having such a hard time getting through here, because it could chop it a little bit different. But twist? Is it twist? Whoa! Oh, I see. Thank you. It out. I got the bags made here already up vacuum bagger ready to go and then I got the fillets here in big big chunks collar still left on this I got them some scraps I was be eating for a sushi lunch and we're gonna go ahead and get these vacuum chopped into smaller steaks and vacuum bagged up catch clean cook bluefin tuna catch clean sushi bluefin tuna <laughs> Fillets, pat any moisture off.
darkness, yeah. Salito Marina here, Northern California, San Francisco Bay Area. Okay, here we go, Mikey SD Fish and Sips. Been taking a look at smoked bluefin tuna. Take a look at these fillets that I got here. Beautiful bluefin tuna fillets that I got here. Look at that. Got the fat, nice fat content. Some of the toro right here. Beauty, beauty, beauty. I had these all filleted up, bagged up all nice. We're gonna chop them up into slices, long strips. How you chop it makes a difference for the, for the smoke fish. So we'll take this fillets, chop them up into pieces, and then put them in the brine. I got the brine right here already made up. Coconut aminos or soy sauce, chili garlic, and honey is what we're working in here. So, got the chili garlic, soy sauce, honey, but we already have it made up. So, I'm gonna go ahead and get these sliced up and into the brine. Just beautiful cuts. Check it out. I always like to pat them off to get the moisture off after they've been sitting in the bags. So I package those up all nice. Now we're gonna pat them off, get them sliced. Like I was saying, I like them in long strips. But look at that fat. Fatty, fatty, fatty bluefin tuna. It's the regular stuff. The fatty, crazy. Let's get it sliced and into the marinade. Look at the 
bomb cuts. Toro. Some of that striped Toro. Wow, that's how we're doing in California, bluefin tuna style, living the dream. Yeah, Mikey here, SC Fish and Sips, Sushi Chef, ch ch chopping it up. We're gonna get this going on the smoke, but we're gonna make some poke too. I got my my cut right here for my poke bowls. Use some of this too. Get these on the smoker. There it is. We got it all sliced up. I'm gonna put it in. Mix it around the marinade a little bit. Get it all soaked up nice. Let it marinate for about four hours, five hours. And then we'll put it on the smoker. Looking tasty, beautiful. Check it out. I got my bluefin tuna here marinating. I'm just gonna go ahead and take it out. These beautiful strips. Look at that fat. And let them dry on the rack here. Put the fan on it. And do about 30 minutes each side. Nice fatty smoked bluefin tuna. Toro. Good stuff. Just enjoying some poke down at the beach. I also made this into doing it a lot of different ways. So you can see I'm taking them straight out of the marinade. Okay, got my fan right here. Turn it on high. Thirty minutes. There we go. Smoke blue fan, fatty toro. Smoke blue. Looking good. Fish and tip style. <laughs> okay, it's been about a half hour on this first side. I'm gonna go ahead and flip these bad boys. Let it go for another 30 minutes. Put it on the smoker after that. Okay, next up, I got the tray here. Warm it up. smoker and get my gear ready for tomorrow we're going fishing on the solo skiff for the Hoya. Hey, the fish has been sitting in front of the fan for hour total half hour each side we're gonna go put it on the smoker 45 minutes to an hour i don't like to let them dry out You can see the skin's all nice and shiny. Pelical skin with that fat combo. Woo-wee! The dream. Smoke bluefin tuna on the Traeger. All loaded up nicely. Let it warm up and cook for 45 to an hour. I'll flip it halfway through. Traeger time. Up, getting the skiff ready. Tuna. Eight 
have it. No blue fit on the Traeger. My favorite. Beauty. Okay, Mikey here. SD fishing tips with the smoke. Traeger smoke bluefin tuna. Now that I got it taken off, smoked all nicely on the tuna. You seen that? I'm gonna get it packaged up in some vacuum bags that I made right here. So let's take a look. I'm gonna go ahead and put three to five pieces in each one. Look at that beautiful fatty belly piece. One, some chunkier pieces. Two, we'll go with this piece down here, three. Seal it up. Then I'm gonna make the rest, some of these smaller pieces into the spring rolls. I'm doing spring rolls, I'm gonna show you how to do that. That's a beautiful bag right there. Got one, two, three, four, five, little six pack smoked bluefin tuna on the Traeger Mikey special. Check it out.